Gentlemen, I'm here with your winner for the Celsius post-fight interview, Blonde Brunson. Welcome to the PFL, my friend. Hey, it feels good to be in the PFL. Uh, great opportunity. A lot of fighters, a lot of millionaires tonight. Feels good. And those gloves suit you. Was that the kind of fight you expected from Ray Cooper? You know he's got that scary power, but you were able to dominate. I mean, your strike count was ridiculous compared. Yeah, you know, uh, Ray's a tough guy. He's not to be taken lightly. He's not Chris Curtis that's in fighting in the UFC and a lot of top guys, former uh, UFC champ Roy McDonald. So you can't take this guy lightly. He come out here and bring it. I wanted to finish him, but hey, we got job done. So tell me what the thought process is coming and joining the PFL. Or do we see you in the regular season next year? Are you thinking about maybe a Bellator fighter in your future? What, what are you thinking? I came here to ball. Where the hell is Jake Paul? <laughs> Hey, I came for the big fights. I want to uh, put PFL on the map. Uh, they showed faith in me, brought me over here, signed me, and I want to put a hell of a show for the fans. And uh, next time, we're going to look to come out here and get a finish. And do you find this change of scenery gives you a new lease of motivation? Because you've already achieved so much in your career. Like, how do you stay motivated to keep getting in here and putting these performances in? Yeah, uh, you look at the top guys in the world fighting for belts. I was dominating these guys in the first round, so I got tired of beating myself, and I actually feel good going three rounds and having cardio at the end. I invested a lot in my road work, and it paid off. Always great to see you in the smart cage, my friend. Welcome to the PFL. Congratulations. Ladies and gentlemen, Blonde Brunson.